One minute remaining for the RIT Tigers. Maisie up along the near side. Tyler Maisie doing the work himself. Fed down the ice. Now here's Maisie with Ferraro on him. Maisie gets held up at the blue line. Fans chanting RIT. 40 seconds remain. Trying to get it through to Fab, it could not. And we get an offside call with 33 seconds remaining. John, last year, the loss to Mercyhurst in the semifinals. The year before that, a 6-0 wipeout to Air Force. How far this program for RIT has come? They've waited four years. Certainly the last two years, how they were beaten badly by Air Force, the heartbreaking loss to Mercyhurst in the semis. To come out here the last two nights, snap a five-game losing streak here at the Blue Cross Arena and do it in their style. Good defense and goal scoring is what they're all about. You saw the fans with the keys. That means warm up the bus. It's a tradition at RIT. Mazur shot in front, cleared down the ice. Five seconds to go. Celebrate RIT, celebrate Rochester, New York. The Tigers, for the first time, are going to the NCAA tournament. What a tribute to Wayne and his staff, to the players, to the school, to the administrators. Well deserved, well earned. Great job. There you see Cameron Burtz. Five points tonight. Jared DeMichael allowing just the one goal. Boy, you want to talk about an all-around effort tonight. The Tigers are going to the NCAA tournament. Your final score tonight in the Atlantic Hockey Championship game, 6-1. to one. RIT, your thoughts, John DeTulio? I mean, just complete domination, not only last night, but tonight. Completely controlled this hockey game right from the opening moment. Uh, Well-deserved. This was a goal right from the get-go. Not only win the regular season title, but to win the conference tournament. Now they're off to the NCAA tournament. It's now time for the trophy presentation. We send it downstairs to public address announcer Rocky Parada. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for the 2010 Atlantic Hockey Tournament Most Valuable Player. From the RIT Tigers, Cameron Burtz. And now at this time, we'd like the captains from Sacred Heart to come forward to receive the 2010 Atlantic Hockey Tournament Runners-Up Trophy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Sacred Heart for their great season and an outstanding run in the tournament. Now presenting the 2010 Atlantic Hockey Tournament Trophy, sponsored by the B2 Networks, please welcome Bruce Levine, Senior Vice President for Sports Programming. And now, would the captains from RIT come forward to receive the 2010 Atlantic Hockey Tournament Championship Trophy? will represent Atlantic Hockey in the upcoming 2010 NCAA Division I Men's Ice Hockey Championship. To see where RIT will be playing next weekend, the NCAA Division I Men's Ice Hockey Selection Show will air on ESPN2 at 11.30 a.m. tomorrow.
see the team photo and the RIT Tigers get it done. Their 10th consecutive victory and the season's not over. It's not over yet. They finally, after four years, are off to the NCAA tournament, proving they're the best team all regular season, really all season long, proving it this weekend, outscoring their opponents 10 to one. Wayne Wilson, everybody at RIT, just congratulations. Yeah. Congratulations to Wayne, assistant coaches, the players, the administration. I tell you, this is Tigers made history tonight. Tigers made history, and it was great to be a part of it here tonight at the Blue Cross Arena.